Hey everyone, today we're diving into a hot topic buzzing around lately, and that is AI. Now, I know this term triggers mixed feelings, especially in the photography space. Some fear it as a potential job stealer, resisting the wave without giving AI a fair chance. And on the flip side, there are those, including myself, who view it as a powerful tool to help with our creative workflow. Now, AI is here and embracing it is key. So choosing the tools that align with your vision can enhance your workflow. The world is evolving and adapting is crucial. Otherwise, you risk being left behind. Instead of a doomsday a scenario, I see AI as a time-saving ally in my content creation journey. Any opportunity to streamline my workflow is worth exploring. And that's where I'm excited to share with you guys Imagine. In AI. This tool is a game changer, promising to slash editing times for our photographers. Imagine AI analyze your past photo edits to craft your personal AI profile. Applying this profile to your Lightroom Classic catalog takes less than half a second per photo. The AI profile understands what adjustments are needed. Uh, be it to uh, be it white balance, exposure, color correction, and more. With Imagine AI, you're always in control. So you review the re you review the results in Lightroom, make make the tweaks that you want, and then you can see that Imagine AI is evolving alongside your editing preferences. To unleash the full potential of Imagine AI, you need around 3,000 photos to feed into this system, allowing it to learn and create your unique personal profile. It's a game changer for high volume shooters who often apply presets. After reviewing and adjusting and finalizing the edits through Imagine AI, this step helps the AI comprehend your editing style better, making future adjustments closer to your preferences. Now, Imagine AI is a constant learner. It fine tunes itself with each use. So the more images you feed into Imagine AI, the smarter it becomes in mimicking your editing style. I recently fed 3000 images into Imagine AI. So why don't we go ahead and take a closer look at the results. Okay, so after you put in your 3000 photos, Imagine creates your AI profile. This is what it looks like in here. I Now this is what my editing style and when I, when I look at it, yes, it does look like my editing style. It's a little bit dark, but we're gonna brace it up a little bit. That's not a problem, but take a look at this. Take a look at this. Do you see the temperature? The temperature and the tint, it varies. It changes. So that's how you know that this is not just like a one preset that applies to everything. Imagine actually does take the time to fine tune each photo for you. So it, it's never going to be exactly the same, which is great. And these does look like some of the photos that I would used to edit so it's pretty good that imagine does this that looks like and it does a pretty good job it does a really really good job honestly this is how i would edit it it got really 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 close which is freaking nuts that looks pretty good that looks really really good i'm gonna keep that imagine does learn how to edit like me <laughs> so i can just feed this into ai uh, just feed this into imagine and um, it does a pretty, really good job. And all you got to do is just fine tune it and then just again, upload it. And then uh, once you upload the final edits, it's going to l memorize and learn how you edit some more. And then after that, your AI profile just gets so much better. But what do you do if you don't have 3000 photos to feed into Imagine AI? Imagine AI also created a light version where you can just feed Imagine AI one of your presets. In my recent shoot with Lisa, I applied my personal preset, uh, the Cinefeels Eternal look to achieve a certain look. While some shots turn out great, moving to different locations with varying lighting condition does pose a challenge. So manually adjusting and especially tweaking, e tweaking exposure for each photo consumes valuable time. And additionally, Applying the same preset led to some images appearing overly warm due to the fixed color temperature and tint settings. So this is where Imagine AI comes in. Again, using the same preset, I create an AI light profile with Imagine. By expressing my preferences, whether I lean towards darker or lighter images, or warmer or cooler tones, specific color tints, Imagine AI worked its magic on the entire catalog from the Lisa shoot. The result is a balanced and more consistent look tailored to my liking. Even shots with different color temperatures were harmonized to maintain a cohesive appearance. This adaptive capability is going to save you so much time. Furthermore, Imagine AI offers features like automatic cropping and straightening. And so this is like freaking crazy, man. I'm like so super excited because 
Not only does it enhance consistency, but it also saves valuable editing time. Hey, let's talk about weddings. I know Imagine AI will be such a huge help for wedding photographers. As you know, being a wedding photographer, you are shooting in some tough lighting conditions. You go from outside natural daylight to inside with some warm lights, sometimes neon lights, sometimes LED lights. It depends on the venue you are at. Sometimes you are in a barn with very minimal lighting. White balance changes all the time. That is tricky to edit for any photographers. So I wanna see if Imagine AI is up for this task. And this time I wanna do things a little bit differently. If you guys don't have your own profile yet, you're not really good at editing yet, so you don't have your own presets, you don't have the 3000 images to feed into Imagine AI, you can always use one of Imagine AI's talent profile. They have different looks from all of these talented creators. And since this is a Fuji channel, I'm going to have to show my boy some love. Jonathan Branch has a talent profile that you can use on Imagine AI. If you guys don't know who Jonathan Branch is, he is also a Fuji shooter that creates a lot of content around a wedding photography and Fuji film. So it's nice to see that Imagine AI is showing uh, Fuji creators some love. <laughs> so why don't we go ahead and click on his profile and we're going to see what Imagine AI does with it. Look what it's done with the wedding dots that I've gotten from my friend Carolina. And this is the before and this is the after. So it looks very well exposed, properly exposed. And I think it looks pretty, pretty good. Imagine AI also cropped it in for us and straightened out our lines, which is great. To be honest with you, I think this looks like Jonathan Branch's shots uh, from what I've seen in his Fuji videos. This does look like his presets and this is before and this is after. Give it that nice uh, feels. Different lighting conditions. Here it is. Different lighting look. It's like a warm, it's like a warm light and then you bring it up and it looks nice and crisp. And look at the shot right here. It's cropped and straightened in. Like a, the Imagine AI is pretty smart. It knows that, you know, this should be the centerpiece. And this is what we need to um, crop into. These warm lights, I'm not really a fan of. So I do like this type of look when it comes to any of my shots. Because I've have dealt with these similar lighting before. I prefer it to look a little bit more bright and cool instead of warm. Before, after. With this shot, it boosted it up by like a two full stops, right? And Imagine AI is really, really smart and only uh, boosts up what is necessary. As you can see here, in, a, in this shot, 1.74. So again, each shot is different because of each scenario's difference, which I like because um, with a preset, it's going to be the same parameters. If it's at one exposure, then for the rest of the photos, it's gonna be boosted up by one full stop. So this is pretty cool because it adjusts everything accordingly. It's not a one size fits all type of preset, which is amazing. And this is amazing for wedding photographers. And look at this, different lighting scenario. Again, super orange, brighten it up, cool it. See, it even have selected the subject and it knows to boost it up a little right here. See, this is this is a pretty smart AI tool. And if you want, you can see here it says Ima Imagine Mask on it. It does everything, it crops, it straightens out the lines. It masks your subject if you tell it to. Maybe what I would do, duplicate, there we go. I would just boost it down just a smidge, there we go. That looks good. Looks nice and crisp. The groom is happy, the groomsmen taking photos. Hey, Jonathan Branch, your pro your your talent profile is pretty good. <laughs> natural feels it is. Certainly natural feels. Beautiful. Oh, I love this. I love this shot. It may be a little bit too much, but here. Some people like that high key look, but you can again you can just adjust it. Wow, that's pretty. Okay, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of Jonathan Branch's profile. These are 500 shots, 500 wedding shots, all edited with Jonathan Branch's talent profile. And I think it looks really good. I'm not a wedding photographer, but these shots look good. And these shots are similar to what I've seen in uh, wedding photography before. So this is just really, really good. Before, after, before, after. See, you see how dark it is here? 
It's kind of hard, right? And I think Imagine AI did a pretty good job of balancing the light. Congrats to them, the bride and groom. That's also beautiful. Different lighting scenarios. This, this AI is pretty smart. I didn't do much to the edits. I just, you know, dialed back the exposure here and there when I, when I think I feel like it's too um, bright for my taste. But for a wedding, this is pretty good. Like I said, like you can't get this from a preset. If you were to take your one preset and batch process all of this, it will look completely different. AI is smart enough to adjust these white balances on each photo separately. And this is where I think it is very powerful and it will save you a lot of time as a wedding photographer. So uh, thanks Jonathan Branch for giving Imagine AI your talent profile. This is pretty good. It's really shown me how powerful this um, AI tool can be for like people who are constantly shooting weddings like every week. They have to meet like certain deadlines and you know they don't have time to come in here and fine tune everything with their presets. AI is a game changer. It's gonna help uh, speed up your workflow, your process. And I can see this being so beneficial for, you know, professional photographers out there. This is pretty good. If you're intrigued, check out their pricing on their website. It breaks down to just five cents per photo for professionals juggling various shoots, whether it's weddings, uh, portraits, street photography, who value time and efficiency. This AI tool could be a game changer. Don't be chained to your computer editing all day. Free up that time for what truly matters. You can add in more clients or you can just spend quality time with your family or you can just uh, pursue, you know, passion projects or, you know, your personal projects that brings you joy. So if this resonates with you, give the software a try. By using my link, you'll even receive 1,500 free credits from Imagine AI. A big shout out goes out to Imagine AI for sponsoring this video. It's partnerships like these that enable me to produce quality content for all of you guys. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next video.